We're gonna make a really easy gift. Um, you could probably make this gift for under three or four dollars. You just start off with a plain white pillar candle, and then you need some regular printing paper and some tissue paper. And you take a piece of your tissue paper and you look for the piece that doesn't have any creases in it and you just go ahead and cut that out just a little bit smaller than your piece of paper your piece of printing paper and you go onto a word document or something that you can print off of and you go ahead and write um, whether it's uh, Christmas lyrics or if you have a poem that you'd like to write to somebody um, you can personalize it with a picture and you're going to take the piece of tissue paper after you cut it and place it on your um, printing paper and you're going to go ahead and tape that down so that this way it doesn't move and you want to make sure that you tape all sides. You don't want anything um, sticking out because you don't want it to get caught in the printer and you don't want a paper jam. So go ahead and tape that up. And then once it's all taped up, you go ahead and print out whatever saying you want to put on the candle. Um, I printed out a little picture of Frosty the Snowman and then with part of the verse. Once it's printed out, you're going to cut that out. You want to make sure you get all of the tape, but you don't want to cut into your saying. You don't have to be perfect because you're not going to see this on the candle. So once you get that done, get rid of those scraps. Take your piece of tissue paper off. So you have your saying on your tissue paper and then you have your candle. Um, there's a couple different ways you could do this. Now you can take this and you can measure and if you wrote too much you can trim the bottom or top and I'm just going to trim this a little bit because I don't want it to overlap in the back so we'll trim that off and if you don't you do have to use a hot air um, gun if you are afraid to use this because it does get extremely extremely hot um, with your fingers holding on to the um, tissue paper, you can take uh, thumbtacks or push pins and you could push them in back here. Um, I like to hold it because I could really hold it taunt. And then I do it on about a six on the heat gun. And if you use this, you don't want to use it in your kitchen. You want to use it somewhere. I have a, a piece of wood here because what's going to happen is this is going to melt the candle and melt the tissue paper right into the candle. I start directly in the middle and we really heat that up. It may take the gun a minute or two to heat up. It's starting to heat up now. As it starts to heat up, you're going to see the candle and the tissue paper almost becoming one. It's gonna become really shiny. You're gonna see the candle melting right over the tissue paper. You don't wanna hold it on too long because the candle will melt and drip and you don't want drips. So I go through all the middle and then I'll start coming to the sides and I'll keep working my way out all the way to the back of the candle and you can also use a scraper a wallpaper scraper and if you um, get little ridges you can warm it up and then uh, use the scraper to smooth it out so I like to use my fingers because it just I can hold it taunt that way but I'm sure you can't see it in the video, but you can see it. Actually, it looks like it's becoming wet. So you want to just keep going. And it dries pretty quick. 
but you're just going to work your way all the way around the candle, all over the tissue paper. Once I start getting near the, the back of it, it's sticking itself, but I'm going to just use the scraper so I can just make sure it's smoothing out. These are beautiful for weddings. If you take somebody's wedding invitation and you transfer the wedding invitation onto tissue paper, onto your printer, and then go ahead and transfer it. I bought the candles for about $3. A package of tissue paper, which I could do probably 50 candles, I bought for $2. The scraper and heat gun I had. You can do it with a blow dryer, but it takes a long, long time and the air kind of blows the tissue paper. Just want to make sure all your tissue paper is melted in. And then that's it. It cools off right away. And now you have Frosty the Snowman with all the words on a candle for a gift. If you love to craft, come on over to rachelferrucci.com. There's a lot more posts for you over there. Enjoy your holiday.